Okay, there. I dug out some PD music too. This is why I don't like changing the cables. Number one. Your PSU is always going to be black unless it's modular. And even if it's modular, no OOEM that I know of sells white cables. Be do it yourself, ain't it? Numbered her. Number two. Plastic cables.
If you're going to replace cables, at least opt for like braided or something. Number three. You can screw up the boot order of the computer. Like, can you even tell I changed the cables? I've kind of been given the impression that the developer of this game might be located in the UK. So I have a playlist of like 20 PD songs. Just I selected the more chill ones. Because I do have some more epic ones and funny sounding ones. These 
ones came from Free PD. Cough, cough. Creepy.com. Black cables again. Hello, Valiant. At least the RAM upgrades are kind of obvious. I don't know why people would want black plastic cables in their computer. Like you don't even see them.
Okay, let's see dragon. That one sound is so darn loud. Generic antivirus scanner go.
Alrighty. Almost through the back hole. Then. Okay, pretty much anything is an upgrade. Now we used parts. $700 budget. See, here's a PSU that has white cables.
So this is a massive upgrade, really. Look, man, I don't know why you didn't pick up your PC. But if this were a real store, it would sit in a corner for six months and then it would be sold. Wait, this is, is the same.
Okay, it looks like there is no value in holding onto the old messages. No potential lawsuits. Uncle Tim, you kinda suck. Okay, that cleans up the email. So should we try to predict what this guy needs? More, uh... Actually, that budget may as well be in your thing. The guy's budget is exactly $50. Here's the thing in a 9, 280 is reasonable. Given the date the game takes place in. It's always the CPU that awful.
I want a better graphics card. CPU is cheap. Oh, he wants a different brand in tally. Okay, am I second guessing the computer again? This is a bad idea. Mixing memories.
thought so. So a four hundred dollars GP was would work. So a thought occurred to me.
The score numbers are awful specific. They must be based on real ones. Thousand twenty Okay, let's cross-reference this. That CPU is all that's not even in the 3 mark database. Okay, I cheesed it a bit.
a score around 5,400 as a Ryzen 5 3600 and a GTX 980 Ti. Like you have to understand that people with trash systems don't benchmark them. That why there aren't like Ryzen 3 with GTX 900 datas. Anyway, I said I would try and cheese this. These parts are absolutely ancient. The difference between the part in the middle and the one on the left is not significant. The game is probably gonna make me do it anyway.
By the way, 3 Mark is not a testing tool. Mark is basically a way to compare your PC performance with similar configurations to see if your system should be wiped. Like most of the computers I've ever serviced either got wiped because the user wanted to or because the store couldn't be bothered to actually fix a software problem. See, another cheap CPA. Okay, let's just buy another one. You get a 980 and you get a 980 This one probably doesn't need to reach as hard. Eh? Yuck, dust.
You know, there has yet to be a PC design that doesn't collect dust. Here's a fun nitpick. Three D Mark is a licensed software. You should be removing it from the PC after you're finished. Are we tired of this music again? We've only been listening to the same three songs for an hour. And I made a point of having a break before I switched to it, in case I have to mute the VOD. But it is PD, so it's not like I would have to mute the VOD, just it will be a pain to dispute a content idea. Okay, this needs only a slight bump. Like, that's the difference of two neighboring CPUs.
and I7 would probably get it there. So true story. When I replace the current PC I have. I couldn't get the Seagate drive to fit in a stupid cafe. So that the drive I record all the VODs on. So I would not be unwilling to part with Budoif, but I was kind of annoyed that somewhere along the line, a typical 3.5 inch hard drive no longer fits. Is this another? I want black plastic cables for some reason. Ack, stupid novel writers. I say that, and that's exactly how I write sometimes.
powering on. Another 3D Morse score snarl. So this one star review at the top. For some reason I could I can get the PC to leave. So I'll just take it as either a bug or something. I don't get the four star ones. Like, if they're just going to give me a four-star with new parts, I may as well just give them the used parts.
So this one is likely going to be a CPU, an AGP of grade 2. Linus Touch Tips apparently has a video review of this game. From four years ago. I'll bookmark it and check it out later. Nice. Like Sagna said, angels must be good computer technicians. No wonder they work from the cloud. This one is open, so I think I ordered a part for it already. This game, who is Team Group? Is that a real brand? Apparently it is.
Sure, sure, get the fur. Sure, could have fooled her. So in checking the local store's website, no team group stuff. Checking the other one. Okay, so Canada Computers carries the team group stuff. See, I was like that, so a fictional brand. Oh, I build me a PC, but I want to pay as little as possible. This is the first email with that kind of request, so let's just uh, accept. Let's see what the tutorial does. So here's the thing. The computer game itself only checks visible objectives. So if the budget is $750, then any computer that meets the objectives will work. And I've never played this game before today other than to test it. But I know this based on the last nine hours of playing it. You must minimally meet the objectives. The 
that people aren't real, so you aren't going to have people scream at you for anything. I have PTSD for this one lady at the electronics store. Between the sales rep and myself, she was overbearing. Basically, you know how racist stereotypes about people come from. Well, this was likely one of those situations that would look not out of place in a TV show. This lady, wearing all this religious stuff on her, basically kept demanding more. And eventually, I just was like, whatever, I want her to go away. So I just installed the stuff on it and ignored the situation until it was done. Contrast that with the guy with the Dell who didn't want to get his upgrades from Dell. I was like, sure, I can do that, but are you sure? And he went with it, so I was like, okay, but no take backs. Sure enough, he did come back. Now to be clear. I worked at a store that was acquired by Best Buy. But this was under the original branding. And the sales reps were on commission. Not the tech support people. So here's the thing.
I only worked for that store for a few months and I just didn't come back after Christmas. You like Sagna. I'm not saying the lady was mean for being religious. I'm saying she was just full on. You told me this. Would take an hour. It's been 55 minutes for my computer kind of thing. Like she probably wasted as much of my time as it would have taken to install the software uninterrupted. But yeah, if you see people wearing a lot of religious paraphernalia, you're probably going to have to change your expectations. When I worked at the call center, I had on average a small handful of angry callers every day. When I work the escalation queue, it turns out a lot of those angry people just want to speak to someone else, period. to realize though those people in the escalation queue are sitting right beside the people that you just tore a strip off to escalate throw Also, also in some cases, like with some outsourced call centers that have people work from home. The escalation representative can hear the entire call.
So you cannot call and yell at someone, ask to speak to someone else, and expect different treatment. Because chances are, unless the representative got in over their ear ears, the escalation rep will just tell you the same thing. By the way, the call center I worked for no longer exists, but the company who operates it still does. And the client still exists. There, they had entered. Anyway, that was a fun side track. Like Sagna, of all the jobs I've had. The ones working on computers were the ones where I felt time didn't drag on. But the ones that felt the most empowering were the call center ones. Because nobody can harm me. Okay, is there not a way to do a shopping list for this? Like Sagna, I'm fine with it being gone. Everything went downhill when Singular emerged with that and Tian bought the other baby bills.
so it was only a matter of time before things were going to get worse. The call center I actually enjoyed more was the auction side. Because it lit lit literally this. Email contacts. Remove listings. Mostly of the copyright infringement kind. So it was very much my mood. Somewhere they're KB Lake boards, but not Kaboos. While AMD is cheaper, maybe I'll look at that. Okay, so I'm gonna wing it.
Uh, what memory speed is M4? AMD website say it says twenty six sixty six. All right, what Chessa? Hello, Strider. ATX must mean standard ATX. I keep seeing this red one, so let's use that one. Hopefully that was everything.
Have a good day, Lexagna. I need to stop doing the thing where I pull the part and then leave it. That the wallpaper strider. I'll be right back. <laughs> 